I start each school year with SMART goals, so students learn how to create their own goals, and that gives them their start of their path, because now they know if they want to focus on math for improvement or reading. Each child has their own unique personalized learning plan, and so the interview that takes place is with the classroom teacher and the student and there are a series of questions that they'll be talking about. You know, what do you want to be when you grow up? What are your plans for the future? Okay, I want to be a, an astronaut. Oh, okay. The last thing I want to be is a wrestler. Okay. We like to build on the student's strengths, and so they'll incorporate those strengths into their goals for their personalized learning plan. What strengths do you notice that you have? Dependability. How does that help you in school? Because um, I like to do my work. This morning the students were working on their Chromebooks, on their PLPs, setting goals for the first trimester. They had six questions and they were answering them, reflecting. What career am I interested in? What I am interested in is a nurse because they do a lot of great things to people. They do. Each trimester kids get a chance to set new goals. We look at the goals if they've met them, how we can change them a little bit. Do we want to make even higher goals? Can you guys think of a goal you have for yourself for this next trimester, something that you could achieve? What do you think, Brayden? We'd hijack their books. Most kids, if they've met a certain goal, they want to do it and add more. And then when they do that, it's just amazing. All right, now you are going to become biologist. Are you ready? Yeah! All right. You know, we're finding more and more that it's about how students learn in that process and really being as effective as we can in, in the total learning process. I think especially at Galt, they understand that and understand to really teach the whole student. As that student becomes more aware of how they learn, they become more effective in the learning process. And I think when they set their own goals, it means more to them than if I tell them you have to do this certain amount this trimester. So they set their own goal based on what they want to accomplish. This year I want to achieve my math. Google Classroom helps me on my math tests and stuff. So, yeah. We analyze student data to look for ways that we can support each and every learner so that they continue to grow and move toward their own personal goals. These are our goal settings. We have normally three goals for every week. I said I will complete 10 Lexia units right here. And then this is our whole entire class for goal settings. Personalized learning is happening in all classrooms. Children are setting goals and teachers are providing the tools necessary for children to achieve the goals based on their needs and their strengths. The children are happy, they're challenged, they're working individually but they're working collectively. They see their teachers and staff as mentors and coaches and they really strive to do their best. Any volunteers who'd like to go first? Thank you, Daniela, you're awesome. I'm always trying to find out what is it the students want and what is it that inspires them? Because I know if they're inspired, there's no limit to what they can do. 